Today we are solving question 151, reverse words in a string. In this question, we are given an input called S, which is a sentence. Um, and our job is to simply reverse the sentence uh, without including any of the preceding, uh, or I should just say extra spaces within that sentence. So you can see in example one, the sky is blue becomes blue is sky the, so on and so on with the next examples. So let's go ahead and learn and code together and get this going. First step is we need to um, split or um, yes, yeah, split the initial array by spaces so that we can get it into an array and iterate through each character or each word. So we'll do this by saying s dot split. And we want to split it by spaces. Then we're going to initialize an empty array that we will use in a little bit, which will also be our answer. Um, so now we're going to iterate through S um, from the back to the front. So we'll say for I in the range of the length of S minus one for the index. And then we're gonna go till we are past all the elements and we're going to start from the end. So now we need to say, hey, is the element that we're on um, a word? So the way we can do that is by saying S, or we'll say if the element is alpha, I forget. Let me double check what it is. All right, here it is. Um, this is what we'll say. So this will say, hey, is this an alphanumeric value? If it is, we are going to append that value to our answer. And then once we're done with that, we are going to initialize a new variable called J that starts at number or starts at one. And we'll say while J is less than the length of S, we're going to say um, answer dot or insert because we need to insert this at specific uh, indexes. So we'll say insert at J index. We want to insert a space. And because we don't want to continuously uh, enter spaces at the next index, we're going to say J plus equals two. And then once we're done with that, we can simply return our answer array joined together. So it will be a string in the final format. So let's go ahead and run this. See what we're missing here. Oh, so this should be the length of answer. Sorry. There we go. There we go. It works for that. And it works for this great runtime. So that is my answer for, let me go ahead and back out so you guys can see the full code all in one if you want to screenshot it or something. So that is my answer for question 151, reverse words and a string. If you guys learned anything at all, go ahead and leave a comment, leave a like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell. I'm posting the leak code question every single day, and then your support means the world to me. So with that, have a good day, and I'll see you.